How to use OpenSea with MetaMask. Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how you can use your MetaMask with OpenSea. OpenSea is an amazing marketplace to buy and sell NFTs and we will be connecting our MetaMask wallet with our OpenSea and we will create and sell our NFTs. So let's get started. First, what you have to do is just come to OpenSea.io and you will land on this platform right here. On OpenSea, you can actually create NFTs, buy them and sell them. It's one of the largest NFT marketplaces out there. When you get started with selling your NFTs or you're into NFTs now, you are creating one, you will actually, you know, explore OpenSea. And if you have MetaMask as your crypto wallet, before we get started and we connect our wallet right here from this option, which we will be doing, let's just go to MetaMask first and let me show you that what does your metamask do and how does your metamask actually looks now uh, to get metamask what you have to do is just simply you know you can go to a metamask and after that you just simply sign up for your wallet and once you have created your wallet which is super easy it literally takes 10 seconds to create your own wallet uh, you will land right here on this dashboard you will see your currency in ethereum which is the customized for metamask if you want to change it uh, you can just simply go to any main networks you can actually you know change any of these now before we go to OpenSea, connecting our wallet to OpenSea is super easy but i want you to add a an other custom mainnet to your metamask when you are going to be using OpenSea. because on OpenSea, what happens is you can actually buy and sell nfts without the gas fee which is crazy right uh this is what we want we want to sell and buy nfts but the gas fee sometimes is too much and then we we are worried that how to do it right so we look for different ways to buy and sell nfts without the gas fee and you can actually do that on OpenSea when you have your ethereum on polygon so to get polygon on metamask you do not get it right away when you have your metamask so you will not see the option of matic mainnet which is the network for polygon so what you have to do is you can see it right here because i have already added it so what happens is you simply click on custom rpc and here we can actually add a new network so what happens is network name the name will be medic rpc now you will actually get this link from matic.network slash doc get there and you will see this link right here get that link and after that chain id is for matic it's 137 so what happens is you add this id right here after that the symbol of course is optional it will be matic and then if you have any block explorer url it's optional if you do not want to add it just leave it that way so what's going to happen is just add this network right here which is called matic mainnet so you simply add this network right here uh the chain id because i have already used it you can see right here so once you have added the chain id and everything you simply click on save and once you click on save you will see the option of matic mainnet right here i already have it that's why i can just you know cancel it uh, so you will see the option of medic mainnet right here when you will come back to your metamask and you will click on here you will see the option of medic mainnet so this is what i wanted you to do on your metamask but if you do not want to do it if you you are not looking for you know cheap nfts you know you can just you know simply go with your wallet you have it you add money into it uh you add your uh some cryptos and then you you are good to go actually but you if you add this you will be able to buy and um, sell nfts without the gas fee so these are the different settings you do with metamask your metamask is completely ready to add to your open See, now we come to our open C and you will see the option of wallet right here in the corner and if i click on it you will see the option my wallet you will see metamask above right here if you have other wallets you can just select them we are going with our metamask i will simply click on that 
once i do that you will be able to see right here that this is a my wallet option and here my total balance is also showing if i want to add any funds i will simply click right here and i will be able to add funds so once you have added your wallet uh, you will see that your metamask is gonna ask you for your signature login uh, there you go you will see the signature request which is from opensea.io and you will see this message right here that the opensea is actually you know asking for permission to connect to your metamask so what you're gonna do is you will simply click on sign and once you do that now our metamask has been connected you will see this right Right here connected option and your now metamask is connected to your open c it was super easy now we can just click right here and it will vanish so you will see now my wallet has been connected if i click on my wallet option you will see my funds right here that my metamask has been connected to my open c it was super easy so once you have added your wallet to your open sea what happens is now i will be able to create any nfts i will be able to sell them or if i want to buy them i can just simply go ahead and do that if i had not connected my wallet my metamask to my open sea unfortunately i will not be able to do anything I want to now i am at the explore of open c and you will see all of these different nfts let's go with tesla one you can see right here that there's this guy nikola tesla the guy who actually invented a lot of things so you can see right here that this is an nft which is nikola tesla not the owner of tesla that's elon Musk, but the name comes from here so you will see the option right here uh, that this is the currency and you will see the option that this one is ethereum on polygon this is why i wanted you to add your matic mainnet to your metamask because you will see this option of ethereum on polygon which is great now i can actually buy this nft without the gas this is pretty good so it's 0 0.1 which is 400 dollars it's not that much actually it's pretty good looking nft so if i want to buy it i will just simply click on buy now and once i do that it will open up my transaction and you can see that there is no gas fee right here so this is how we buy nfts without gas fee i actually showed you another trick guys that you can you know buy nfts without gas fee you can see in my total there is no gas fee uh, so this is 0.1 and i will be just paying for the nft now what i have to do is i will just simply click on confirm checkout and once i click on that it will take me to my metamask you will see right here that now they're asking me to for the permission for my metamask if i had any phones then uh, i will be able to you know buy it very easily so this is how you buy nfts using your metamask wallet if i want to make an offer for example a little less than 473 or maybe more than 473 i can just you know simply make an offer as well so that's basically it that's how you uh, use your metamask to uh, buy and to sell nfts to sell nft what happens is now i will be able to create an nft from here this option create it was not available before if i had not added my wallet now i have added my wallet so i can just you know simply create nft right here and add it to my collection and then i will be able to sell my nfts on OpenSea. So yeah, guys, this is how you add your MetaMask to your OpenSea. Once you have connected your wallet, your MetaMask to your OpenSea, you will be able to create amazing NFTs and to sell them and buy them as well. I hope that I was a big help to you. Make sure to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to the YouTube channel.